Bonjour mes amis, c'est moi encore. I'm going to be reading some more from the book Goethe, Beautiful Heart, my book of poetry and lyrics. And this is quite possibly the last poetry reading that I will be doing on video, just because I think I've read quite a few and I marked my favorite ones. And I mean, there are others that are somewhat intriguing in here. Maybe I'm biased. I'm probably biased, but um, I I just feel like it's it's been enough time and it's probably um, the right moment now that summer's coming to an end to just move on to another venture when it comes to my work. So here we go. Uh, the first one is called the rose bushes. Stepping stones, dusty anthems, foliage, foliage friend, the soft warmth of the beating sun. I had almost forgotten you. I was surveying God's majesty in every color palette when I heard a noise. It was a crunch. My heart leapt. Someone was there. I wasn't alone after all. I moistened my lips whipped my blonde cloak around to see your face. There you stood. I thought you were gone. I was almost over you. No words, no words were needed. You grabbed my hand and pulled me past a tree. I was expected somewhere by three with one of the other men that loves me, the one I'm beginning to adore. Your breath was husky as you pushed me down by the rose bush. I couldn't catch my breath. It had flown, so you took me and stripped me while I gazed into your eyes. I couldn't fight you, even if I desired. We were pressed against the earth and brought back again to the scent of roses and sweat and overdue love. I had almost forgotten how powerful your force can be that enables me to throw away all caution I had almost forgotten your love and graduated from the memory of you until you pressed me by the bushes. That, I thought, is how a lady gets dirt under her nails. Self-explanatory. The next one is called The Scent of Morning. I loved you, like a bird caught in a storm, enjoying the evening without great alarm, dreaming of fragile moments that ended all too soon. And I remember you were quite open to me while I pushed the hair from your eyes. And so I thought this is where I am to be. I would go with you. If I were a girl back home, would it be okay? Then might you smile and invite me to stay forever? Kiss a hand that bled for you. Call it a gift. Um, this last poem, The Scent of Morning, is about someone else. Um, it's, it's a separate person from the rose bushes. So The Scent of Morning, if you saw my last video uh, poetry reading it's about um, the one where I talked about the little church and the, the foreign tongues and all of that it's it's the same person as that one um, written in the same time period and actually I keep a journal of my um, my poetry and it's a separate journal that I have now I used to just keep it and the same thing as my diary but um, my poetry journal is separate now and I write the dates and times of everything in it so I can kind of go back and see how my life is unfolding and, and how things have changed for me um, so it's pretty cool so if you do write poetry I highly recommend that you do that um, you can see how you grow as a poet and how you grow just as an individual on your own this one this one really hits home. It's called the Little Earth Shaker. Don't concern yourself with me. I'm not a box you can peep in to see 
what's there, how I've been, what I'm doing. I don't appreciate your carelessness. I don't appreciate how ridiculously easy it is for you to erase me and all that we were. Was love a fever you caught and somehow out won? Don't concern yourself with me. I wouldn't dream of shaking your modest little world. Okay, so, um, <laughs> that I, I think is probably going to be the end for these readings, at least for a little while. Um, thank you so much for joining me. Um, merci beaucoup, Fosela. And again, you can find Le Beau Couer, The Beautiful Heart, on Amazon, Kindle, Books, Books a Million, Barnes and Noble, um, any of the online sites. Unfortunately, it's not in stores right now, um, but you can order the paperback and the hard copies um, as well as the Kindle copies. Um, there's a million more stores that you can order this from online, so just search it out. You can also go to my website, that's daniellebienvenue.com. Or if you say the French way, Danielle Bienvenue, D-A-N-I-E-L-L-E-B-I-E-N-V-E-N-U.com. You'll find some more stuff about me and how you can follow me um, on Instagram or anywhere else. <laughs> uh, and also on my Facebook because I have a, a author and um, songwriter page on there. Thank you so much. Et à tout à l'heure, mes amis. Avez un bonjour. Au revoir.